What's going on guys, it's Smack here, bringing you another tutorial video on how to get the AeroD Gaming Center. Uh, I tried to get the AeroD Gaming Center, but I just couldn't find a way to possibly get it. And once I found it, I wanted to share it with it, but I was basically lazy to make a video of it, so I'm doing it now. So let's first of all say I did not find this method, someone else basically found it. I will credit him in the description, so thank you. He also provided a download link, so let's not waste any time. And let's get straight to the setup. Once you've downloaded the file in the description, it should be on the top of the description, you will get this file. It's the RG Gaming Center. Now you want to open it. Of course, you need WinRAR for it. I will leave a tutorial on how to get WinRAR in the description too. But you will get these files. Now what you want to do is you want to right click on it and click on Extract in RG Gaming Center, blah, blah, blah. That will give you this. Now once you basically have this, there are a lot of things, but don't worry, don't worry. You only have to press this setup. Press the setup, press it twice, then hit yes. Now, once you've clicked on yes, you will basically get a prepare to into install. And you just gotta follow through the setup. So, it's really easy. Alright, so once you're here, just click next and you can check where you want to install it. If you, even if you have a laptop, which is mainly used, this you can just for everyone or just me to install the gaming center. But it doesn't matter, just hit next and hit next again. Once you're here, it will say it is installed. Hit close and said you must restart your system configuration to make RG Gaming Center to take effect. Click yes to restart now. Now if you want to restart right now, just hit yes. But I'm going for this tutorial, I'm going to open the gaming center. Now there will be a shortcut made onto your desktop, but you can also press the RG button. I will put a picture of it right now. But I'm just gonna press the shortcut. So, we are currently in the gaming center. As you can see, um, for me it is Dutch, for you it will be English or whatever country you are, you're using. Alright, this is basically my motto. And these are all my uh, specs. So, I have like the Core i7, uh, Nvidia, Nvidia GeForce GTX 1050, and how much RAM and stuff. You can also make profiles, etc. Now, it's also fast connection to go to GeForce Experience if you have it installed. I do recommend if you're a gamer having installed this. This just basically gives you so much options. As you can see, you can instantly go to your drivers. But let's go back to the games. That you also have the ARG error core, which I already made a tutorial on. As you can see. And of course, it has the ventilation. Now, it will usually go on auto. But you can actually do it on max. Now where is this for? So as you can see it's currently pretty much heat. It's 70. Uh, it's almost 70. But when I do it on max. You might actually hear a little bit more noise. Because it's going insanely loud guys. It's just insane how loud it goes when it's on max. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial video, it was a quick video, it's no click blade, this actually works as I, as I guys showed you. Now I want to thank you for the um, support on the RNG error core, I'm trying my best for you to help everyone. Be sure to leave a video a like and to share it with your friends if they want, if they have the RG gaming center or they want it or something or they have problems with it. This should work. Now, if the download link is broken, please let me know and I will update it or try to update it as much as possible. This is version 203, so it should be pretty close to the newest one. I'm not sure though. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.